so I'm in the After Effects CC. So firstly, go to Composition and make a new composition. And I want PAL white screen square, and uh, these are the height widths. And frame rate 25, resolution full, and uh, duration I want 10 seconds. Now click on OK. This is my background color. If you want to change it, you just simply click on there. You can change it. Now click on OK. Uh, now I will put some circle on there so that uh, hold this button and you will get ellipse tool uh, we have this fill and stroke I want only stroke so firstly uh, click on this fill you will get a hand uh, I want none click on there if you want to color in any other uh, gradient or any linear gradient you can click there I, I want none now click on OK uh, click on stroke I want solid color for this stroke now click on OK uh, now press shift on the keyboard and uh, draw a circle here uh, this is my layer panel after after effects and this is my timeline so go to this ellipse tool uh, firstly I will rename it right click on there and rename it circle now you will get this arrow explore it now ellipse then we have this stroke in stroke we have stroke width okay so firstly I want to make it animate uh, like it is popping uh, firstly I will position it okay that's fine mm. uh, this is my timeline and I want this animation about uh, in between 0 and 1 second like this uh, click this uh, stopwatch then your first keyframe will appear and uh, move it to here and uh, it is about 17 seconds you can check here now again I will increase the width of this now again after 19 or 20th second this is 20 second and uh, I want this value to 0 now see this this will, it will appear like this that's very fine mm. now hide all uh, options now right click on there now we have this uh, effects then uh, transition we have Venetian blends click on there uh, Firstly, select this uh, and uh, set its position to this middle keyframe so that we can see the stroke of this. And uh, if you want to change, see this uh, in the upcoming tutorials we will uh, more learn about the keyframes but it is very simple to understand for this especially pop circle uh, okay now if you want to copy this layer especially uh, just press ctrl D means duplicate the layer and uh, make it small press shift on the keyboard so that we can can change its angle to this direction something like this now uh, I will check it so that uh, 
now problem with that uh, this circle is this is my second circle and it is moving from up to down so I have to fix it so this is my second circle so explore this and you have these uh, position and scale and uh, now these two stopwatches are running so we have to stop all these two stopwatch and uh, remove these key frames firstly click on there click on there right now stopwatch has been stopped and the key frames has been removed now see there and uh, it is now not moving it is just blinking so for this second uh, circle I want to blink it just after this bigger circle so move it like this if you want to make another circle by pressing ctrl d you can make it and uh, firstly we have and uh, if you change the position a new keyframe will be appeared so simply stop that now see here that's fine so in this way you can create a pop circle so I am ready with the video go to composition uh, I have to render it go to composition then um, add to render queue in render queue window click on render now it will be render so thank you friends keep watching our creation